Are you a side sleeper? You tired of mummy bags that don't fit? Enter the Nemo Disco 15. Spoon shaped bag that doesn't suck. It's on the upper tiers on the 650 downfill sleeping bags. What's up? I'm Alan and this is Borderline Explorer, the channel for you if you enjoy backcountry camping and off-road touring. Today, we're going over the Nemo Disco 15 sleeping bag. I've got both the male and this is the female version here on hand. All right, let's be real now. How much would you pay for warmer nights at camp? A sleeping bag isn't all you need, but it's a big part of it. Let's get this out of the way. One of these bags is about 300 bucks a piece. And honestly, that kind of hurts a bit at checkout. But warmer nights. It's a reality we have to face. It gets cold at camp. In my experience, I'm willing to suffer through the night, but didn't want to keep this up for the rest of my overlanding lifetime. And for my wife, she's got to stay warm. Enter the Nemo Disco 15. If one good thing came out of 2020, it was this bag, and I really dig it. The Nemo Disco 15 comes in male and female options, and a 30 degree option as well. The shape of the bag is roomy for side sleepers. I'm 5'7 and a back sleeper, so it was almost too spacious for me. 650 fill down and quality materials. The outer shell is ripstop with hydrophobic coating to keep the bag dry. So when down bags get wet, you lose your fluff, and this is all you're working with. This is all the useful insulation that you can get. And it makes me wonder, how do you clean bags if they get really dirty with hydrophobic coatings? If you know, let me know in the comment section below. The foot box is waterproof from the outside, yet breathable from the inside. How does that work? Humans are geniuses. The main zipper has a plow so you don't snag and rip material. So I'd say this is, yeah, pretty standard high quality for a sleeping bag in this price range. But what separates this from the competition? This one's got gills. Two zippers that reveal thinner material to allow heat to escape should you need it. Side sleepers like to break symmetry and now you can keep your back cooler if it gets too hot or your front warmer should you choose to. Whatever you want. You can keep one open, the other closed. Open both halfway, or maybe just both fully open. The choice is yours. A cool idea from Nemo, but here's the reality. I don't want to adjust my zippers at night, wait to see if the temperature in the bag is right, and regulate and fine tune the bag temperature. At night, I want to sleep. Also. Thermal gills have the zippers that do not have the plow, so they might snag the thinner material. Some other gripes I've got with this bag. The pocket size. It's tiny. And while I'm whining, I might as well throw in how much harder it is to pack down the wife's female version of this bag into the stuff sack compared to the male version of the bag. The extra fill in the female bag makes it harder to fit in the stuff sack. I think that the male and the female bag, they just made the same size bag in different colors, but the female bag has so much more volume that it's just pain to stuff in. Okay, so we talked about the stuff sack. Now what about the other bag that it comes with? It's breathable and mesh, and I am glad that Nemo threw this one in. For down to fully fluff up before bedtime, you want to remove it from the stuff sack in advance because having it in the mesh bag lets it fluff up without worry. Unless your worry is space. It doesn't take up that much space. Also, after a moist night, uh, if a lot of condensation can build up, you can leave it in the mesh bag to dry out. Thanks, Nemo. And another thanks for the Philo. Well thought out. Shape for side sleepers so your shoulder is gonna elevate your head above the ground and you're gonna need a pillow. Choose pillow or choose neck issues. Throw some clothes into this little compartment and you have yourself a pillow. A philo. I can definitely appreciate how Nemo makes words up. More brownie points for having a draft collar. That is this 
little piece of material that you can form a seal with on your neck so that the rising warm air in your sleeping bag gets trapped in the sleeping bag. Material on the draft collar is super soft too. Verdict? I want a warmer bag. <laughs> Neo made a great bag but I still want something warmer. A zero degree bag. 800 fill bag is likely my next buy. We might end up in Alaska one of these days and I don't want to just be not cold. I want toast. I want to be cozy. The fill is great on the bag. Certified and legit. True to its rating. The Nemo bag also just looks good. I think it looks good. It's eye candy. Some guys go online to look at women. I go online to look at outdoor camping gear. And it looks good. Woo! Okay, that's it for this one. I'll leave a link in the description if you want to get one yourself. Connect with me on Instagram. I love connecting with the Borderline fam. Find me at Borderline Explore. Stay cozy and try to live a little. I'll see you in the next one. <laughs>